Hi guys, welcome to part 4 of this tutorial. Um, for today's video, we are going to make a simple small cabinet. But before that, we are going to adjust this side to make a space for our cabinet. And then this one too. Like that. And then, as you can see guys, um, the room is a little bit, yeah. Um, so we are now going to add a cube and then just place it and before that we are just rename, rename your mesh like that and go into the top view um, and then place it when it, wherever you want guys and then scale it on x axis like that and also on z axis to make the height um, taller I guess and just adjust the the cabinet guys uh, whatever you like um, and then just apply this scale because we scale it so we need to reset the scale and on the edit mode we are, we are going to add a edge loop and then select the paste of on the top part and then extrude it along normals like that and we are going to add an edge loop at um, two edge loops and then select all the three paces in the front and then just press the I on your keyboard to make an inset paces and then we are going to extrude this one um, by pressing E and move it backwards and then by pressing I again to make an inset again and then extruding it outside like that and now we are we created this simple cabinet and then once you add a bevel there's nothing there's nothing um there's nothing going around about it because um we need to bevel this one on the edit mode like that by pressing ctrl b selecting all the edges that you want to bevel like that um but First, we need to bevel the corners to make it more smooth, I guess. Like that. Select all the corners, guys. Um, and then, just by pressing Ctrl B um, and holding down the ship, you can adjust it a little bit. Like that. And then, the top paste also um by selecting by choosing select and select more we can bevel this one but first we need to deselect this one by pressing c and then middle mouse on your on your mouse um you can unselect the edge on the top part like that to make a smoother smoother side on the top part like that and then also the bottom part um, just press ctrl B to bevel it and then bevel the bases also and then by cursor to select that you you can add a spear on a on that particular place so you can make a 
handle um, just scale it like that um, just follow my steps guys um, and then apply the transform and also set the origin to geometry and then by selecting the back side or back vertex and select selecting more on the select and then select more you can select more of the vertices like that and then also select the front part front vertex and then just move it by turning on the proportional editing and then move it like that guys to make a simple handle and then place it on the cabinet guys like that and just scale it a little bit and just place it and that's our simple handle now we are going to add a array modifier on the modifier tab and just make the value on x 0 and the z just adjust the z axis to have this look so here guys um, now we we are done with the simple cabinet um, for the next part we are going to make a windows on our room and by that um, but first we are going to adjust the height of our room on the edit mode just select the faces on the top part and by pressing G to move it on the Z axis by 2 like that and now we are done with this part and guys thank you for all your supports and I'm hoping that you can follow my steps and understand and learn something you know thanks